हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल लाइफ एट एफ एपी एंड टूडे इन दिस सेक्शन आई एम गोइंग टू कवर हाउ टू डिलीट द डिलीट द एंट्रीज फ्रॉम द टेबल विद द हेल्प ऑफ डी बगर मोड सो बेसिकली इन रियल टाइम सीनारियोज वी विल गेट इन सम सीनारियोज वी नीड टू रिमूव सम लाइन आइटम्स एट एट टेबल लेवल uh this is not this will not occur every time uh, randomly this will occur uh, only once in a year like that so if we have maintain any z tables mostly this is uh, applicable for the z tables uh if any entry uh, it's uh, we, uh, the entry is automatically maintained or any posting that happened at multiple times and uh, duplicate entry is there in the z table so uh, it is impacting the report which is uh, which is uh, Uh, in the front end, uh, the report is uh, linked with uh, that Z table, and uh, we want to remove. Uh, then only we want to remove that line item. Then only that report will uh, show the balances uh, balances accurately. So in that scenario, uh, we have to use the debugger mode uh, and uh, edit the table. And and the in in uh, in the edit mode, we have to remove those line items, that unwanted line items or uh, duplicate entries. so today i will take an example of uh, basic table and i will show you how to delete those entries okay let's get started now so i am going to f16n now so here my basic this is basic table and my company code is 2000 and the physical year is 2023 so now here we can see number of the entries uh, as you can see the number of entries here 132 okay so now i have given the my required parameters here company code and a physical year and now we have to slash h and hit enter so the debugging debugging is switched on now we need to click on execute here uh, it will take some time to uh, go inside of the program yeah uh, so now i will select this desktop 3 this is a very comfortable screen for me and now here we have to enter gd fn ad at ad and gd fn sap ad at and then we need to edit on this things and here we need to just simply enter the x x hit enter and click on continue this button so, uh, continue or f8 anything is fine and then it will take a few seconds yeah so here we can see total uh, 132 records are there so this out of 132 records i will be going to remove one document it means uh, i need to uh, delete the two rows one is a debit and one other one is credit so if you want to delete the rows you need to uh, select here and uh, click on this one, this icon delete rows and if you want to add the rows we need to uh, click on add rows and then we need to enter the data and if you want to change that row you need to select and uh, click on this one append row then system will uh, act accordingly so i am uh, removing this line item here this one and two line item with the document number is uh, 1000 ending with one so i have selected one entry here and uh, click on this delete row and the same time the other line item also for each accounting document will be having a two line items at least uh, at least uh, one is a debit and another one is credit so we have to remove both if any document is duplicating yes so then uh, just click on save see here uh, deleted rows 2 inserted rows 0 and changed rows 0 just click on this one and go back now my uh, system should show the entries as uh, 130 30 entries should show In, uh, earlier it was uh, 132 now its system should have to show what 130 records only yeah here we can see 130 entries so this is the way to delete the entries from the table level uh, with the help of debugging mode uh, generally this will <coughs> excuse me so generally this will uh, we, we have to perform for the mostly for the g z transaction z tables only yeah 
uh, that's all uh, in this section thanks for the watching uh, my videos and please do subscribe and uh, please uh, if you have any uh, uh, any comments or if you want me to make any videos on the, any particular session just comment me on those uh, things so i will uh, i will plan accordingly and i will do that one thanks a lot